Hey, hello there, everybody. Welcome on back to more Revita. Last episode, uh, I mean, nothing short of total disaster in a lot of ways. Um, what is our gun of the day? It is the rocket launcher. The little spicy boy. Okay, it gets a little explodey. It's a little strong, right? It's a little strong, but that doesn't mean that it's not going to be a good time, right? Should be fine. Let, let's take some stuff here. Um, honestly, take the first two. Joker card, and then the lovely pearl, and and we'll see what the heck they do. We're we're getting close, man. I mean, we still we still have 33 items uh, that have not been unlocked, which is a lot. Um, shard 18. Let's let's do it. Oh my freaking lordy, dude. Wow. I mean, I kind of feel the need to do it, right? Let's take triple shot. It's a horrible idea. Let's take damaged ammo as well. I think I'm going freaking insane, man. I think I'm going insane. Um, we'll also emit bullets upon taking damage. Okay, I'm I'm making a run that should not exist. <laughs> I'm making a run that should not exist. We are allergic. That's okay. That's not a problem. Um, we'll go with the, with the bed. Do a confusion run. It's a confusion run today. Uh, so what the heck do we have? Lovely Pearl increases the chance for rare pickups to appear. Spicy. Joker card counts as one towards every relic synergy. I still don't really understand the relic synergies, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, but I am interested to see what happens. Let's just shoot this. Okay. So our, our rate of fire is about one shot every uh, month and a half or so. Uh, <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> I, what, what can I say? Um, crap, crap happens. Crap happens. Um, <laughs> all right, good, good rocket launcher run, everybody. Um, let's, let's try that again. Let's try that again. Maybe, maybe with a, a different, <laughs> a different subset of items this time around. Um, wow, that was, that was rich. Uh, let's take the wind-up key. Uh, literally have no idea what our items actually were, uh, which is unfortunate. Well, dude, let's buy a ticket as well, um, because we're not gonna have any, right? So we'll, we'll take a speed upgrade. I could have done a chaos ticket, I suppose, but alas, here we are. Um, fun times, fun times. We will go for bloodlust, because I don't think it's that bad for this scenario. Would have loved to see what that last run could have looked like, um, but unfortunately, we, we got put into a, a little bit of a position that was a little bit of an interesting vibe for sure you know yeah you, you can't really you can't do too much complaining about life when you get a synergy so good or i suppose bad in a lot of ways um that you kill yourself in the first 15 seconds of a run um it's impressive it's satisfying i love every second of it um is good stuff is very good stuff anyway uh welcome back to more revita today uh i i'm feeling good today right i'm feeling good it, it's a, a spicy revita day it's a brand new day in in the tyler cinematic universe what the hell that was a heck of a jump dude you you really gave that your all on that jump uh don't 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 shoot me um i recorded the voiceover for our uh, spicy, spicy run, ah, dude, I think we should take. I think we should take. I think we should take. It's just, it's a, it, it's not as good as what you you may think. Oh man, it's tough. I'm still gonna take it. Getting a curse for it makes it makes it really painful, in my opinion. But increasing your rate of fire is pretty good. We'll take allergic here. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's it's not the best item in the universe, I'm going to tell you. Uh, because you you really don't want to take damage. I mean, you don't want to take damage ever, right? That's just kind of how it works. But you don't want to take damage in your hearts since they're your currency. Unless we get a really cursed run, right? And not in the sense of it becomes weird and a little alarming, but it becomes like literally we have a lot of curse. 
Um, then it actually kind of will work because then you're you're paying in shops, you know, bare minimum. You're paying uh, in curses, not hearts. So we save the hearts for other things. It, there's a lot of spicy, right? There's a lot of spicy, but being able to crank the... Bolts have a chance to freeze. That's fine. Uh, cranking the fire rate up is going to be a little bit better for us, I would say, in the long run. I'm liking the freeze, man. There's there's something there, for sure. Could, could be uh, a nice little benefit to have. We also, damage is good enough to one-shot uh, flies. That's, that's a big, big play for us on this one. Um, I really, I, I know I've done a run with the rocket launcher. Here's your, your secret room. Little spicy rooms here. Little spicy rooms. We, we don't love it. We don't love it. We don't love you. We do not love you. Thank you very much. My friend, freeze them in midair and then smack them. I love to see that. Okay, let's get this show on the road. I'm gonna not do the B floor today. We, we just did it um, in the episode the other day. So I, I, feel, uh, I feel like we don't need to run B floor today. It's really hard to tell where our secret rooms are. That's definitely something we, we want to get. We want to make sure we're, we're truly checking every wall when we uh, do our, our secret room checks. To make sure we have it all figured out. Give me a nice spicy relic. It ain't that spicy. What does wind up key do, man? We didn't even look. Wind up key, orbital spin faster. I should have probably taken the brick blocks. That that would make a lot of sense. Um, I honestly probably would have. This is gonna give us a relic though, which will be a, a nice little, nice little benefit on the run. I am just not at all concerned about this fight. This is this is some easy stuff here. We're, we're gonna walk away with a, a nice brilliant relic. Thank you. Is pocket rift? That's fine, dude. Um, like I said, I think that this actually works. We we want to go the curse portal route. Plus, I think the extra the extra damage boost allows us to kill off the the harder enemies. You know, meaning the the jammed enemies a little bit more easily. Is this our this our champion? Okay. I am I am not concerned about him. We we just gotta land our shots. He will die. Is easy money, man. Is easy money. What do we got? Shade cloak. Uh, is look. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good in the slightest. But you, but you take it as a um relic to get rid of to upgrade another one. Um, and, and we're a okay with that. And we may do the same thing around here too. I think panic button's actually like a good item for us. Lowers our damage, but we're, we're getting that rate of fire really cranked up. We take shields for sure. I'll give it a small reroll. I would love to have orange juice, man, but we will now not be able to afford it. Probably wasted half a heart in that process. Um, there's there's not really a whole hell of a lot we can do about it. <laughs> you know, we, we, we take a little bit of... Take a little bit of pain in this situation, but life is fine. You can see our fire rate is pretty spicy now, which was exactly what we were going for. Uh, it's gonna, it's gonna probably serve us well. You know, the thing is, you're you're always going to be able to get damage in Ravita. Damage is not the problem. This is a small boss room, man. It's a small boss room. Keep in mind, bosses are harder now. That's, that's our, our shard level, is this guy has more uh, shots that he punches out. Um, but we we can always find damage in Ravita. Finding rate of fire is a lot harder. It's a lot harder. So the fact that we've got, you know, two items now to increase rate of fire that we can focus on upgrading um, probably serves us well for the future. You know, it's a, it's a small investment. You know, I put... I put all of my Ravita coins into uh, Ravita Kid Block Chain Crypto Coin. Ravita Coin, Kid Coin. Sounds too much like Kid Cuddy. I don't think I like. I don't know. Kid Coin's not working for me. But we we have good stuff going for us. That's all that matters. Look, uh, two damage ups. You'll love to see it. Plus, also your HP up from the memento. A ticket for the next run. I'm really not upset about the first floor. Um.
We, we've got a good foundation. That's all you can ever ask for from the first uh, floor of the run. I'm also definitely, like, getting rid... Phoenix Egg I'm okay with. I don't even know how I got this, um, but I'm okay with it. I don't think we need Shade Cloak. Um, I think that that's probably unnecessary. I'm still confused about the memento. I I'm going to be real with you. Because if I get rid of it, it's basically the same as me using a full heart for something, but also, like, not really as well. So that's 15%. This is higher rate of fire, but then also kills my accuracy. So th this is not as valuable for me. I think you want to crank this to get that huge rate of fire upgrade. I also think that you want to get the Phoenix Egg going immediately. And then the rest of this, I, I don't really care about. Um, panic button, uh, trust me, I'm not I'm not saying the panic button's bad here. We, we may still go that direction, but I want to see... I want to see a little bit more... I want to see where this run goes before I commit to upgrading panic button. Because the, the accuracy... God, yo, ooh, how did I not get hit, dude? That's insane. That dude charged right into my soul. And I am extremely surprised. Okay, this run's pretty spicy, man. This run's pretty spicy. I, I feel like I just haven't used the, the rocket launcher enough to, to really know how strong this can be. It's obvious that, like, it's going to be strong, right? I'm, I'm basically firing... The equivalent of a, a Revita RPG at enemies. Um, so it is good. It's definitely good. It's also like it's hard to see. This this little Phoenix friend is nice until he's not, because <laughs> he he does make my visibility go down ever so slightly. Okay, this is fine. Just 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 crank him in. Just a little little spicy here. A little spicy. Uh, the fact that we have moved our way out of here is is a blessing. Okay, and now I'm dying. Now I'm dying. We did so well at the beginning of that room, and then it all went downhill. Um, our health is obviously down a little bit. Uh, I got hit by something, and I would love to know what the hell I got hit by. Uh, it seems like that seems like a true true painful situation. I'll take second gear. Um. Combo chain increasing more just means more soul, right? So it's, it's not horrible. There, there's reason to uh, to not take it there since your HP is a little fricked in its current spot. But I, I make my decisions. Whether they are good or bad remains to be seen. Thanks for the key. Unfortunately, I, I actually just straight up can't do this room. So there's no reason to go in. I don't have the HP for it. So we'll just... We'll just happily abstain for the time being. We, we appreciate them giving it to us, but there's not much we can do. Celestial weapon time. Okay. I I would love a celestial weapon. It's, it's the damn truth. I would. Uh, this, this is a little messy, though. And by a little messy, I mean it was a lot a bit messy. Um, and now you're you're a hit away from death. You You are a hit away from death. You will bring that back right now, but it, it's it's a little bit of a struggle. I think we're seeing that, you know, our, our high rate of fire run is not necessarily as spicy as what we originally intended for it to be. A 10% damage upgrade is nice. We, we don't like getting hit again, though. I can also, so I, I can I can slow down that cancer grenade throw and make it a little bit better. What do we got over here? I don't know what the wishing well is. <laughs> We've never been here, so let's let's see what's going on. A mysterious deep well. Would you like to throw one of your relics inside? Okay, so do you do one that you don't care about? So like wind up key. I'll I'll chuck wind up key in. The blessing of the well upgraded the relic. Okay, um... <laughs> okay. I mean, this is good to know, right? It's good to know. I do wonder if there's a random chance to just, like, not get anything from it, which would obviously be not ideal, um, but would be on brand with the whole Revita, Revita lifestyle. I'm absolutely going into the Curse Rift, man. You know, I, I still think that our, our damage is good enough on this run. 
to handle. Uh, this is a mess. This is a mess. You, you love to see good dodges, though. Those are the kind of dodges, man, that I, I look at where I used to be in this game. And I go, you know what? We've, we've gotten something figured out in terms of uh, combat. I'm, I'm better than I used to be. <laughs> and sometimes that's good enough for me. Uh, we somehow cranked up a, a decent amount of hearts, man. Which is uh, pretty nice. It's pretty nice. Still got some spicy rooms, but... Gonna need to get rid of you. Gonna need to get rid of you. Damage needs an upgrade. Damage needs an upgrade. But it, it could be worse. Yeah, that was bad. That was bad. I, I still, I get screwed up with this phoenix, man. I, I keep on thinking that the phoenix is a, an enemy. And I'm, I'm getting, uh... I'm getting messed up by my own, my own helper. Dude, there's so many souls in here. I'm, I'm full up on soul. We, we should heal, man. We, we should heal. Make sure that we're getting our, our maximum potential here. Since we, we got souls all over the room. I also, I, uh, we're a hit away from death all of a sudden. <laughs> how the heck did that happen? Um, I also still am a little bit confused about how my rocket launcher works because it seems like it can hit me if i if i fire it and it hits me um but also like sometimes it, it doesn't so i'm i'm not a hundred percent sure how that's working all i know is i i hit the fire button survive 30 seconds these are sometimes the spiciest because it's occasionally very very hard waves that make it more difficult to survive. I like this one, though. Th this is a fine challenge. This makes me want to just, like, chill the entire time and uh, let these guys just sit on the top. Make my life a little easier, but I think another wave spawns, so we probably do not want to do that. Uh, okay. I'm a hit from death. I'm a hit from death. I would love... Uh, bandana's good. Bandana's good. Bandana's good. Um, it is It is clear to see that things are a little scary, though. It's a damn superfly. You gotta go, sir. You guys also gotta go. Okay. Okay. Little spicy. Little spicy. I'm, I'm thinking a death is probably imminent on this boss fight. Um, this boss is hard. On, on shard 18. Poison in the middle of the room does not make life any easier as well. Um, but I'm... We're, we're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna try, right? I'm not, I'm not gonna give up. We're, we're gonna try. Okay, you got me. The flawless is, is toast. You putting an enemy into the room does not help my life in any way. Okay, you're out of here. Toss a grenade. Dude, the poison does not make life easier. We, we lose a lot of walkable space in the game. <laughs> okay. I like you up there. Okay, sure. Come back down. Um, That was so lucky. That was so lucky. All right. All right. All right. All right. Dude, it's, it's, it's so tight. It's so tight. That thing doesn't take damage. That's the first time I've ever tried to shoot it. I think we're golden. I, we're actually golden. Okay. <laughs> yeah, what's a little... It's not a flawless, but what's a little... Make the run last a little longer on a beautiful uh, time here. Vampire knife, pretty good. We do get a curse out of it, but... I mean, at this point, dude, you gotta just roll with it. Necromancy sucks, uh, but... What are you gonna do, right? You, you can't take... Uh, you can't take that other curse. So, we'll we'll just move. Spicy run, you know? Keeps keeps our our life humble. Um I would like to I do think the bandana is good here. Um I, Dude, I don't know. I don't know, right? Um let's do this. Let's do this. Then let's do this. You're probably like, what are you doing, Tyler? 
Oh yeah, I can't I can't get rid of that. Okay. Um well we're on we're on we're one hit. We're one hit. Is that is that bad? Probably reason to believe that that is bad. Okay. Well, you know what they say. Just uh don't get hit. <laughs> can't die if you don't get hit. So in my eyes we're we're looking we're looking good. We're looking good. Am I terrified? Absolutely. Thanks for asking. Absolutely. Um, especially because we have to do another room before we get the the upgrade that health upgrade that we need to survive here. Oh, um, that's no caved. That's fun. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> you know what? I I respect you. I respect you. We we knew we knew we were dead. We knew we were dead. Okay. Um, tough run today. Tough run today. We ain't starting another. I'll I'll do a, a wee bit of fishing at the end of the run here. We got 25 bait. So let's uh let's keep the fishing going. I do love still. Um one of the things I love most about Revita is is run length. Because most of the time, I mean look, that's that's just a tough run. Um I, I gave away a lot of health. Um it wasn't that hard of a run, right? Um, we, we had the, the means necessary, I just didn't play very well, and then got a little bit risky, you son of a gun. I, I didn't play well, and then, and then took some risks, but you're not often going to die in the third area anymore, at least in my opinion. Um, so you, you have a run that, at least for content creators, is guaranteed to be around 25-30 minutes, which is like the most ideal run length for a roguelite. Um, you know, the runs now get up to about 40, sometimes 45 minute, which is still very good, right? Um, that's, that's like my, I just accidentally right clicked. That's my like, you know, standard roguelite length, but God, do I love a short, a short, quick roguelite, man. Space Gladiators is a game that I feel like did it really, really well. You know, those runs were, they were like 20 minutes and that's it. <laughs> like you, you just, you got a 20 minute experience. It was a brilliant, brilliant little game. Um, I always had a good fun with that. The dragon head, I think he's new. You know, we're still collecting as many, uh, fish as we can. There are apparently two, two like legendaries as well. Um, and I don't think I've caught those. I don't think I've caught the shrub shrimp either, but maybe I have. I don't know, dude. It's hard to keep track of them. We, we have a lot of them, though. I mean, we're, we're really getting a, a good chunk. But now with Ravita, man, it's like, if I have an episode that ends early, I'll just fish, right? I'll just fish. What what a, a stupid, fun little fishing minigame to add to your, your Ravita experience. I'm afraid to know what Ben does in the full release of the game which by the way is coming in soon it's coming in soon um i don't know how long but it, it will be within the next probably two months is my bet um might might be sooner i i don't i, I don't have any insider information i i would not be able to tell you even if i did um but unfortunately i, I do not have any insider info but i'm i'm frightened to know how much content is going to be in uh, the 1.0 release. Ben has mentioned that it's going to be like 1.5 times the amount of content in the game, which is a little insane, right? Because the game feels like a very complete experience to me right now. So to have even more uh, in the 1.0 release is, is terrifying. I'm super excited for it. You, you know we're going to be making content on it uh, the entire entire existence of 1.0 release I, i've got a bunch of bunch of ideas for other fun kind of revita series that aren't just getting achievements but obviously like i'm still I'm still in the process of getting achievements so I, I want to make sure that we're we're getting the stuff so i can show you all of the possible things in the game we have gotten a catfish many a time that one is not a new boy unfortunately I, I do love me a catfish. IRL, not as much. I'm, I'm not a huge catfish person. That said, I don't I don't eat a lot of fish. I don't mind fish, I'm going to tell you. Um, 
Do you know what really like one of my big my big issues is with eating fish? I just don't like fighting with bones, right? So if it's a fish that is a, a very bony fish, I don't like sifting through and like worrying them a choke on a fish bone the entire time. If there is a 100% a, a guarantee that this fish didn't have bones, um, meaning that it was basically just like a pile of flubber in the ocean, I would be like all in, man. Eat fish every meal. I, I love the taste of fish. I love seafood in general. It's just bones get annoying. Now, there's nothing worse than than you're biting into a fish sandwich and then you just like get that crunch on your teeth and you're like, oh, frick. And then you're like sifting through your mouth between like the fish mush and everything else to, to then find that there's a bone inside your mouth and you're trying to f figure out where it is and then get it out before you choke on it. It's just, it's a miserable experience. And I, I just don't want to ever have it, ever. Oh, this fish. You want it, dude. He he just beelined for it. He was like, I need to see this son of a gun. Fantastic. Okay. Reel him in. Reel him in. And then we're going to go talk to our, our boy here. And see what all he, he has to say. I would love to get another lure. Our lure is pretty good. But I know that there are you know likely significantly better ones. We got two of these spiklers here but here you go sir he gave us like 25 uh 25 stuff uh, this would be a hell of a way to fish just blow up the fish in the water um ben you should make that uh, a feature if you shove the rocket launcher into the water uh, it's a little secret that pump po pops up and it's like uh blast fishing and then it gives you a lure it would be such a stupid secret to add that probably would take more time to code than it would take for anybody to actually do the secret. Um, but I, what can I say? I'm, I'm a innovative man of many ideas and uh, none of them are good. I was gonna say, this guy's definitely about to swim away. We haven't had a true battle of a, of a fishing experience in this episode. Hello, the grass crab. You are definitely new. You here to help me with my dinner? <laughs> no. <laughs> I probably should have given him that. Oh, dude, there's a big fish. I'm still trying to find the legendary, man. Or two legendaries. Uh, there's like a whale or something. And then there's there's one other one. I should just try to catch the whale, probably. I don't know if certain fish spawn in, in different areas. I tend to fish a lot at the front and, and not at the back. And I probably should fish at the back a little bit more I have a feeling the big dude is, is already he already left did you already go my friend cause that, that's a big shame yeah, he was he, he did not stick around did he alright this is another catfish man what a waste alright full line cranked we're all the way in the back baby you see this guy right here he wants some oh th this is New fish incoming. New fish incoming. Reel them. This this one's gonna be hot. I got I got all the faith in the universe. This one's gonna be hot. Come on, just get him. Get him. Just when he least expects it, you just crank the reel. He's about to bite. Yeah. I, I look. You think I don't understand? I understand more than you'll ever know. He's about to bite again before I reel him in. Just kidding. Uh, he's mine. It's the vanilla blob. That is what I was called in high school. Just kidding. I was rail thin my entire life. Uh, just kidding. I was actually like a super fat kid. I, I was a chunky little boy. Um, but then I became very rail thin after that. Probably because my main hobbies are um, working myself to death. But that's beside the point. Um, my, my name is Tyler. My hobbies are working and having IBS. Hi, Tyler. It's a, like a, a bad anonymous meeting. Uh, here you go, sir. Thanks for the trade, kid. Thank you for the trade, sir. Uh, so how many fish are we up to? Let's let's take a, a small peeksies. We are up to 37 out of 50. 
Still got 13 to find, man. We'll find them over time. I'm not concerned, but that's going to do it for this episode of Revita. Thank you guys so much for coming on out and enjoying. We will hop back in in the next episode with a, a new gun, maybe? Or are you going to make me keep doing the rocket launcher until you win? No, we're going to hop in with the charge gun, which is a spicy gun. It's a spicy gun. What many people consider to be uh, the strongest gun in the game. So we'll hop in with that. Thanks so much for watching. As always, liking the video. Much appreciate. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.